Lord Nazir Ahmed, a British Pakistani, who has campaigned against India, was convicted guilty of sexual charges against two minors by the Sheffield Crown Court last month. The abuse occurred in Rotherham, while Ahmed was a teenager, according to evidence presented before Sheffield Crown Court. The allegations include serious sexual assault against an 11-year-old boy and two attempts to sexual assault a 16-year-old female. Both incidents occurred in the 1970s. Who is Lord Nazir Ahmed? Lord Nazir Ahmed, the anti-India campaign's face and a Kashmiri separatist, was born in Pakistan-occupied Kashmir and later relocated to the United Kingdom. Nazir has been in the forefront of a vicious anti-India campaign, making caustic statements about India on multiple occasions during the Kashmir conflict. He has also been a strong supporter of Khalistani separatist organizations. In the past, he has been condemned by both Congress and BJP leaders for his tweet on Prime Minister Narendra Modi. During the 69th Republic Day celebrations at the Indian High Commission in 2018, Ahmed organized a Black Day protest in which Pakistani protesters tore and shredded Indian flags by hand. Ahmed had also rented five private billboard trucks with slogans like Free Kashmir, Free Khalistan, Free Assam, Free Nagaland, and Free Manipur, among others. In 1998, then Prime Minister Tony Blair elevated him as one of the first Muslim peers to the House of Lords. In 2013, he resigned from the Labour Party. Lord Nazir Ahmed, who describes himself as a campaigner for Kashmiris, resigned from the House of Lords in 2020 after facing many claims of sexual assault. A House committee had recommended that he should have been expelled. According to the committee report, a group of Kashmiri women in London organized a Me Too protest movement against politicians such as Nazir Ahmed and faith healers who are abusing vulnerable women in the Kashmiri community.